take a look and see what James got in the mail today. Hmm. Well, maybe that's enough. Let's see. Or maybe enough for me to be able to rip it. Hey, all right. Oh, all right. Praise the Lord. what we got look familiar well it should from like here down should look familiar so what do you think of that so I had two of these I traded the other one of these for one of these so I figured why not why not do a comparison that's pretty close, isn't it? And uh, just looking looking it over, I mean, it's pretty cool that it's got the same insignia, uh, same font for 45 and pound. Uh, the letters look a little thinner on the Cisco, like the S and the C definitely look thinner than the Schmidt. Huh, interesting. The hubs feel about the same. The plates look about, the dimensions look the same. Uh, this one is very well, the Schmidt is very well grooved on the back. That's been laved and it is sharp. This hasn't, hasn't had any machining done to it at all. So it will be cool to weigh these and maybe see what I get. I guess I could do that right now, couldn't I? Scale says zero. Do the Schmidt plate first. Should be like 
47 and a quarter or something like that. All right, so I'm getting 47 and a quarter on the Schmidt plate. And I have no idea. I think this will be a little overweight, but I don't know how much. 47.1, so just about the same. Well, that's pretty cool. That's actually very cool, because then I can use them and I don't have to worry about one being, having to compensate one for the other. The difference in weight, which is a problem with the older weights. I'm just discovering something new, which is why I kind of went silent for a minute. Okay, I had not. I just saw something on the Cisco plate, and I see that it is on the Schmidt plate. All right, so I noticed that right away in the T. And so in relation, I'd say it's about, you know, if this is 6 o'clock, I'd say the T is at 7 o'clock. And if you look... It, this has a T that I didn't notice before, and it is also at 7 o'clock. But the, um, you know, the plates definitely look like they have the same dimensions, you know. Really interesting. Uh, let's see, what else can I do to compare? I guess if you want to, let me see if I can. So there they uh, put them too close together, we're not going to get the light. But the hubs are, I would say, just about the same. Yeah, so these, these definitely are the same mold, it's just been a name change. Well, isn't that interesting? Good stuff.